Last year, I decided to gamify my ESL class, so I decided to turn my units into levels and my assignments into missions. I created a storyline for the missions, which focused essentially on language functions. Students created their avatars and took on the missions. They were happy and engaged, but suddenly they turned bored and puzzled. They were starting grammar traditionally outside the main game story, and I had not thought of immediate feedback on their progress. I needed a system to have a leaderboard and award at the points and badges. So I decided to include Zondo for grammar exercises in my gamification. What is Zondo? Zondo enables you to create and play games to support exactly your learning needs. You create sets of questions or choose from thousands of topics already created by other Zondo users which students can then play in games of their choice. That's any Zondal topic in any Zondal game. Zondal has many features, but those I found most interesting for my case were the ability to monitor the students' activities and progress in the gradebook, both by class or uh, to have a clear picture of the progress and weaknesses of each single student. Besides, Zondal offered ample opportunities for giving feedback on the activity, behavior rewards, leaderboards, badges, and zoners, the Zondo money. Definitely what I needed for my gamification attempt. How have I used them? The key were the zoners. You get zoners or expert points as you progress in the answers to the quizzes. Zoners can be increased or decreased by the teacher. I started assigning extra zoners for good behavior and engagement in the game activity. This was helping my class management as well. Furthermore, also the leaderboard ranking was based on the amount of zollers and leaderboards are a common feature of most video games. They give you reason for playing the game. In video games, you gain expert points to proceed more smoothly in the game. Similarly, in Zondo, zollers can be used to purchase teacher goodies. So, I thought of offering as teacher goodies mainly hints and helps on the mission so that the two parts of the game would intertwine and become a single game. When the students passed each mission, Zondal allowed me to assign a badge corresponding to the level or even to a special skill they had shown. Last but not least, Zondal has an Android and iPad app, so students can be kept engaged in the game also at home on their smartphones and tablets.